Hi guys, just going to show you a quick banana and oat um, pancake. I was just about to make it and I thought, oh, let me just do a quick recording. So I've got one banana and I've got in here, it's just um, organic porridge oats, which I've put in the blender and um, in the Ninja, sorry, and I whisk that up and then that's some baking powder. And I'm going to mash the bananas, which I should have done first. And then I'm going to mix it together and then fry them. Right, so I've mashed a banana. That's the consistency you want. You can mash it a bit more if you want. It doesn't really make a difference. And then I'm going to add some ground cinnamon, about a teaspoon. And I'm going to add some vanilla extract into that as well. You can add whatever you want at this stage um, if you want to flavour it with different flavourings. So I've added half a cup of water because I've just realised I've run out of milk and I'm not going to make any until later. So I've added the water instead and we'll see how that turns out. So you want to beat you want to beat this until um, all the mixtures mix together. You can use a whisk if you want. So it needs to be quite thick. going to be using some vegan butter. You can use whatever you have. You can use a spray oil or um, whatever you want to use. I just find that these make them, this butter makes them crispy and nice. So, popping that onto the little pan, as you can see, it's quite hot. Spread that around. spread out by itself. You don't want it too thick. And keep going until you've run out of space or mixture. These pancakes have been frying for about two minutes. And I'm going to turn one. Yeah. There you go. That's what you want, nice and brown. You can have these with fruit or, or more sliced banana on the top or I'm going to do um, a banana vegan ice cream which I'll show you as well. So onto the banana ice cream, I have a banana that I had in the freezer, um, perfectly good banana, it wasn't overripe or anything, I put that in there to purposely make um, ice cream. Um, what I should have done was slice it up first and put it in a bag but I didn't do it on the day. So what I'm going to do now is going to um, peel that and then I'm going to chop it up and then we'll see what we're going to do with it next. vanilla and some frozen fruit some there as well and then we're going to make that into a beautiful ice cream okay so here goes Let's pop your banana into your processor and I'm going to put in a few of these and the mango 
Franco. Okay, so I'm just going to pop this on and This is the consistency of the ice cream. You need to add a little bit of vanilla extract, about two teaspoons, and then this. Ice cream complete. There it is. Nice and creamy. Banana, frozen fruit, a little bit of vanilla extract. 